We are looking at uh, at least a, a cold but sunny forecast for today. So enjoy the sunshine extending into the afternoon, although our temperatures will be running below average. A little bit milder tomorrow, but more cloud cover. And then we'll be tracking that winter storm we've been talking about by the end of the weekend into early next week. 23 degrees in Ann Arbor right now. It is only 24 downtown, 25 in Pontiac. And how you're coming in at 22 degrees. 32 is an average high, just to kind of get perspective on where we are. So our temperatures 10 to 15 degrees below average as we go through the afternoon. Our wind chills right now between about 12, like we're seeing in Ann Arbor, even as cold as 10, the wind chill in Lapeer. So not even into the teens yet. Feels like 14 in Pontiac, Mount Clemens, and also the Detroit area, so downtown. As we head through the afternoon, that sunshine, yeah, it feels good, but just make sure you wear those layers if you're going to enjoy that walk with the dog or taking your afternoon jog. Wind chills in the upper teens by the afternoon, at least in the downtown area. Elsewhere, I think mid to upper teens will cover us. We are looking at quiet conditions, uh, that sunshine extending into the afternoon. Tonight, tomorrow, we start to see a little more cloud cover come in. The system we're watching still has quite a real estate, quite a bit to cover until it moves through. And that'll be by late Saturday night after midnight into Sunday. Already out ahead of it, winter storm watches for northern Illinois, Indiana for expecting five to nine inches of snow. So that is really kind of the bullseye with the storm system of the heavy snow. It looks like it's just to our south, but close enough, we're gonna have to really watch it carefully. Hour by hour forecast shows a dry day tomorrow, so you can get things done. You can run your errands. It looks fine after midnight, the snow comes in. Sunday morning looks to be the heavier amounts of snow. And then we start to see scattered snow hanging on. It looks like at this point into Sunday afternoon and Sunday evening could even see the back edge of this lingering into Monday. Keep in mind, these are very preliminary early snowfall totals. But to get the idea, the further south you are, closer to the storm, the higher the totals could see three to five south of I-94, two to four when you look off to the north. So it does look like we're going to get the shovels out, though, for Sunday into Monday. Temperatures today, 27 for a high with northwest winds five to 10. We'll drop down to 14 degrees for another cold night and then preparing for that storm on Sunday into Monday. Temperatures do recover 40 by the end of next week. Stay with us. We have more 7 Action News ahead.